Hi, I'm Roy McKinstry and I'm the production manager here at the, at the Trapper Mine, the northwest corner of Colorado. Now, I'm Jared Ray, I'm a mining engineer at Trapper Mining. Uh, I'm responsible for the dig and dump planning for the new LeBaire R9400. We needed to find a machine out there that would give us better availability than the wheel loader had been, but would still be a match for the 240s. So at that point, we solicited all the manufacturers in the hydraulic excavator class, and LeBaire came to the table with the 9400. They also took the extra step to uh, develop an optimized bucket for the machine, which would get it right up to close to the maximum RSL of that machine. We've actually seen about a 40% gain in our production in the last three months. One of the concerns we had with, with all the manufacturers was service and support, knowing their reputation worldwide in South America and Australia we felt that they would provide the service and support we needed. The machine went to, got delivered in late January, basically assembled in February, March, April, May, June. Now we're into July, and the LeBaire service has been outstanding, and the parts support has been outstanding as well. The LeBaire R9400 here at Trapper is going to see anything from 30 below, probably 40 or 50 below wind chill, up to 90 or 95 degrees, well over 100 on uh, heat index. Uh, the cold weather package for the winter is going to keep us running uh, basically six months out of the year. Trapper's traditionally been a uh, drag line operation, surface coal mine. And so when we purchased the 9400, instead of giving the machine a, a number, come up with a name for the machine. And the Duke was chosen, and that's basically named after John Wayne.